Changing the primary monitor on Windows 11 is easy and straightforward to do. It's just knowing how to do it. So we've got two monitors as you can see here today. We're actually going to make it so that the monitor on the right becomes the primary or the main monitor. No physical changes are actually needed to the monitors. It's just a few simple changes to your system settings. And I'll be showing you how to do this step by step. If you're new here today and you would like to see a how-to video similar to this one, which helps solve your tech related questions, start now by subscribing to our channel. Okay, so let's dive into the detail right now and look at how to change a primary monitor on Windows 11. So in order to change your primary monitor on Windows 11, you don't physically need to move the screens around, anything like that. You make all the changes within the Windows display settings sort of on the system. So in order to make the changes, if you go down to where the magnifying glass is and if you type in display in the search bar, as you can see here, if you click on duplicate or extend to a connected display. Now, currently our monitor one, as we can see here, is our primary display. Now, I want to change it to monitor two, which is on the right hand side here, purely because it's a bigger screen. I tend to work on it more. The apps by default open on there when they're sort of they're used for the first time. Also, you've got your notification center, your lock screen, and your log on screen, etc. So because it's a bigger screen and it's newer, I want to make that the primary monitor. So in order to make it the primary monitor, if you click on the relevant monitor, which is two, go down to multiple displays, click on the drop down arrow and click make this my main display. You can see now that the apps appear on here. You've got the notifications and some of the other functionality appearing on screen here. I've created some further PC related videos for you, including how to adjust your second monitor from left to right in Windows 11. You can click on the links appearing on screen now. But many thanks for watching our video today. We'll see you on the next one.